everyone back again day two of the 30 day challenge of 4x21 raising money for Mary's meals today is the fifth Sunday of Easter where we hear out of the Gospel of John the passage of Jesus telling us how he is the true vine and we are the branches but what most people forget about is the father is the vine dresser let's get at it Everyone out here, getting at it. Day two of the 30 days for a four by 21 for Mary's Meals. Again, I'm looking to try to get four people every day to try to give 21 bucks, money that you would blow at fast food restaurant or anywhere real quick. That 21 bucks will feed one kid for a solid year and give them an education. So I'm out here doing my run slash walks, my ankles still bother me. And it's Sunday of the fifth Sunday of Easter. Um, the passage today is uh, the one many people have heard before where Jesus says, I am the true vine, you are the branches. And my heavenly father is the one who tends the vines. A lot of people like this one. You know, for the fact that, yes, if I'm attached to Jesus. But the other part that jumped out at me was the Heavenly Father is the one who trims the branches. I do gardening, so for me, it speaks to me. And Jesus used this, you know, because agricultural people he was talking to at the time. So I'm one one who's, I grow tomatoes. And I can know what it talks about where plucking the branches off because if you grow a tomato plant you have the true vine where all the nutrients comes from and you have the branches that will bear fruit but the only way they'll bear fruit is if you got to take off what's called the suckers the ones that you don't want because they'll just grow and it'll take away the nutrients and you won't have tomatoes at the end of the end of the season so it's great to number one be how Jesus says, you know, as long as you're attached to me, you can bear fruit. As long as you stay in my word and listen to me and follow what I've taught, you know, you're good. But the other part that you got to keep your eyes on is the fact that be aware that our Father in heaven is going to do a little trimming on us. It's going to get us so we're not so attached to things. You know, it's all well and good to have our hobbies and things that we love that's in this world. But we're supposed to be in this world, not of this world. So two things to be aware of is stay within God's Word. Take that 10-15 minutes every day. At least that quiet, quiet your mind. Break open the Scriptures. Look at the readings for the day. Let Jesus speak to you. Give you your guidance your bearings, your GPS for the day. But also be aware of God's trimmings of us, <laughs> his cutting back of stuff that we don't need that might keep us away from him. And, uh, that might be stealing our joy and stealing our happiness in life. So I hope you have a, all have a blessed Sunday. Remember, links in the bio, or if you're watching on YouTube, links in the description over to my fundraising page for the 4x21, day two, Mary's Meals. Help us feed 120 kids, 120 kids, food and education for a full year. My simple 21 bucks, you can help us out. All right, God bless, have a good one. See ya, another mile to go, peace.